a local group of young dancers, and they are getting ready for a big performance next week, the halftime show of the Holiday Bowl. Jennifer Martin takes us inside Pat's School of Dance in Hendersonville before they head to California. They know all the steps, they've got all the pep, and now it's just a matter of days until a group of young Hendersonville dancers perform in a nationally broadcast halftime show. I'm leaving on Christmas Day, so we've been like counting down the days till we leave. On December 30th, 36 of them will dance in a group of 325 from across the country during the Holiday Bowl game in San Diego. So as soon as we presented them with the choreography, they've actually learned it on their own. At home and inside Pat's School of Dance, they've been busy learning the seven-minute routine choreographed by Hendersonville's Sheraton Shepard and Dustin Phillips. The theme is called Clash of the Classics, and that's everything that starts out with Moody Blues, goes into the Beatles, goes into uh, Elvis Presley, Elton John, Frank Sinatra, and then finishes up with uh, Tchaikovsky's 1812 Overture. They made sure to match the music with just about every kind of dance. A jazz choreography, hip hop choreography. We had to fit in the whip and nene, the most current thing with <laughs> all the kids. It's a chance for dancers like Caitlin Ledbetter, who hopes to become a professional dancer, to make her mark. Just being able to be out there in front of a bunch of people and being a part of it, it's just an amazing opportunity. And for Taylor Williams, who's been battling cerebral palsy since birth, it's an outlet and a way to inspire others. There's so many other kids who can't do what I can do because they're in a wheelchair or something, and I can show them you can still do this. It all started when Phillips, who's worked with everyone from Janet Jackson to the Backstreet Boys, got a call saying he was chosen from thousands to choreograph the show. They said, hey, we want you to have your own bowl game, and I'm like, okay, where do I sign? <laughs> <laughs> now, as he leads his local students, across the country, teams are learning the same steps before all joining in San Diego as one team of talented dancers. These trips just give them you know that one special thing about them and it's such a great opportunity but until then they'll be busy perfecting those moves and counting down the days until they hit the field to dance in the holly bowl is a kid's dream for scene on seven i'm jennifer martin that's such a fun experience for those people awesome job now you can watch that halftime performance on december 30th at 7 30 on ESPN when Wisconsin takes on the University of Southern California. That should be a good football game. The group is also performing at 10 a.m. that morning during the Big Bay Balloon Parade, which will air on the USA Network.